I'm Justin. The purpose of this video is to show you how to begin generating leads using the AutomatedREI.com and the Zillow scraping tool. I'm logged into the AutomatedREI.com dashboard and you can see to the left here is a vertical menu. You can slide up and down. Find the Zillow scraping tab and select that. That will open up a Zillow scraping campaign builder. Now in the first box, you're going to name your campaign. This is something that I recommend you name where you can remember exactly what you were doing the day that you did this scrape, especially if you're going to be doing a number of these. So you might put the date here somewhere. Now the next question is scrape for properties that are listed with an agent or properties that are for sale by owner. You can select either of these options, but for this example, I'm going to select for sale by owner. The next box is what city? Now you can go anywhere, but I'm going to choose Phoenix, Phoenix, Arizona. Now I could go back here and select Maricopa County, Arizona and do the entire county. But for this example, let's go ahead and do Phoenix, Arizona. Below that, it gives me the option to, instead of using a city, I can upload a spreadsheet with up to 15 zip codes. But for this example, let's search Phoenix, Arizona. I'm going to want to schedule this for a time that's more appropriate for me and for a day that's more appropriate for me. This is when the scrape will begin. So it's set for tomorrow at about 10 p.m. Now, I can also choose to select the box filters. When I do, a pop-up menu appears and you can see it's already selected the listing type for sale by owner, but I can choose homes, condos, townhomes, and manufactured homes and exclude apartments and vacant land. I can also choose a minimum price range and a maximum price range. I can also choose a minimum number of bedrooms. If I want more filters, I will get fewer results. But if I want more filters, I can select the more box and I can choose a minimum number of bathrooms, the range of square feet, the lot size, the range of year the property was built in, how much the homeowners association dues are each month, how many days on Zillow has this property been? And by the way, here's a gold nugget that we share things like this in the business plan of the automatedrei.com where you get six VIP Q&A sessions each week where we talk about strategies and techniques like choosing 30, 60, or 90 days on Zillow to find those extra motivated sellers. You can also put in special keywords like garage or pool or waterfront if you're looking for something very specific. Once you've made all the filter selections that you like, you can choose save. Once you have all the filters the way that you want, now you're ready to click the submit button. Now your campaign is not completely set up yet because first of all, you'll want to check data count to see what your results will be. I'm going to click that big blue button, check data count right now and allow it to think. It's going to take probably 30 seconds or so but what it's doing is it's going and it's finding all of the properties in Phoenix, Arizona that are for sale by owner on Zillow that fit the filter requirements that I told it that I wanted. So it's going to think here for a moment. And when it does finish, it will show us the results, how many properties it's going to have and what the cost will be for me to scrape all of the contact information. Now you can see it's finished it will find 65 properties in Phoenix, Arizona that fit my parameters. The cost to me will be $1.95. If that's acceptable to me, then I can click proceed. If it's not, I can X out of this and go back and change my filters to find a more suitable search. But I'm going to go ahead and click proceed. Okay. Now you'll see this phrase popped up at the bottom of the screen. Now you can proceed create campaign. That's right. My campaign creation is not complete yet because I have to click this green button, create campaign. So let's go ahead and do that. 
you'll see it pops up here in the top right, campaign created successfully. Please check in campaign history page. All right, so if I slide over here to the menu on the left, down to the scraping history tab, and I click that, you'll see at the very top, number one scrape, Phoenix, Arizona, the date today, and then it's scheduled for the time that I scheduled it for. After the scrape is complete, it will change in this column from scheduled to completed. That, that's how you'll know the scrape is completely done. Next video, we will talk about how to use the Start SMS button to create a text campaign so that you can reach these scraped leads from Zillow with your awesome message and start generating property deals for your real estate business.